The doctor is in the house. We are back with our friends here at South Texas Brain and Spine Center. I'm here with Dr. Lewis, and today we're talking about a topic that I've never even heard of, face pain. What is face pain? What could be causing it? And I know some light bulbs are going off for our friends at home. Yeah, it's a, a common uh, uh, condition that's often misdiagnosed. Mm -hmm. uh, people will start get uh, sharp stabbing pain in their jaw or their cheek and it comes out of nowhere, often uh, chewing on something or getting air blowing on their face, mm -hmm. uh, will trigger this pain. Interesting. Yes. Okay. And that can cause you to lose weight because you don't have an appetite anymore. It's just unbearable, right? Right. They don't want to chew on that side. Uh, and they often get misdiagnosed with problems with their teeth, like mm -hmm. they think there's a tooth abscess or a cracked tooth, and it's not. It's actually an artery that presses on a nerve and causes this sharp stabbing pain. Okay, so I couldn't imagine going and getting a tooth pulled, still having that pain and realizing that the tooth could have stayed, it wasn't the tooth at all. So exactly. what kind of treatments do you do for this? But it's an easy problem to solve, usually uh, goes away with some medications mm -hmm. that help calm the nerve pain down and usually within a few days that pain is going away but over time it can increase and get more severe mm -hmm. and more frequent and if that happens then we can do a focused beam of radiation which is an outpatient procedure okay. and zap the nerve so that the pain stays away mm -hmm. if it comes back at a later date then we can put a little sponge a teflon sponge between the artery and the nerve and that will uh, deal with the offending problem mm -hmm. and get rid of the face pain Awesome. I appreciate this information. It's really, really useful. Now, is there any way for somebody to decipher one or the other from home, or is this something that we might want to go... Originally, we we're going to go to a dentist, because it's your teeth, it's your face, so you would think a dentist. Definitely come and check with you guys to get that second opinion before we go and start taking our teeth out. Yeah, a lot of dentists already know that, too. Mm -hmm. They recognize the, the problem and uh, will say, well, your teeth are fine, so it must be trigeminal neuralgia. Good. Okay, so they're yeah. able to sort of diagnose it to a certain extent and let them know that you're the next step. Correct, that we're a center of excellence for face pain. Very, very cool. Okay, well, you know that you can get all the treatment that you need here when it comes to face pain, anything having to do, we've discussed um, back pain, headaches, all kinds of issues. What other things do you are you able to treat here at this location? Well, we, we treat the back pain, we treat neck pain, and we also preserve motion, artificial mm -hmm. discs, so that people don't have to have their spine fused. Okay. I love that you all are able to intervene with more natural remedies and try to take a less invasive approach before it gets to the real deal, serious stuff. I can appreciate that about a medical professional, especially in this day and age. So we love what you guys do here, and we want to welcome everybody to come and see you. So how do we go about scheduling an appointment, a consultation, and do you accept insurance? Yeah, we accept all insurance. Mm -hmm. and we're located next to Christus Spahn Shoreline Hospital on uh, between 3rd Street and Morgan Avenue. Fantastic. All right, so come visit the doctors in the house, Dr. Lewis and the team here at South Texas Brain and Spine Center. They can take care of many of these topics and we look forward to visiting back with them weekly to discuss more. So if there's something that you're concerned with, reach out to us online and we'll bring up the topic with our doctor friends here. Don't forget to mention you saw them on Coastal Living. Coastal Living's Doctor in the House is paid for by South Texas Brain and Spine Center.